Now, students, listen closely, and I will tell you the tale of the dreaded cobra chicken. This is a fearsome animal that knows no fear. It will attack you. It will bite you. It will strike you down with its mighty wings and the bony protuberances on the end of its wings. Yes, this is the dreaded go- cobra chicken. Now, how do you think it got its name? Number one, it's a bird like a chicken and it has feathers, a barnyard animal, but it has a long hissy neck. So, some people who were afraid of it and didn't know English very well called it the cobra chicken. And this cobra chicken loves to live in farmyards. But what do we actually call it? What is its name and how do we spell it? This is a double O vowel word. This is the common goose. G-O-O-S-E. Now, when there is one goose, it is a very happy animal, just strutting around doing its stuff. But they always prefer to be together. So what do you call it when you have more than one goose? You call it, you actually have to switch out for a different double vowel pair. And it becomes geese. G-E-E-S-E. Now, technically, a goose is only a female goose. And the male goose is called the gander, G-A-N-D-E-R. But gander is just a regular noun, and more than one gander is called ganders. Look at all those ganders honking around there like they own the place. So, what you're looking for is goose. Look at all those geese honking around there like they own the place. And remember, you switch from double O O to double E E when you go from one goose to many, many geese.